Hello! This video is part 5 in the series on making the best use of the Rocket Math Online Tutor. It will cover the most important thing you can do as a teacher in managing the Rocket Math Online Tutor motivating your students. We have lots of data showing the Rocket Math Online Tutor is effective. It will work, but only if the students engage and play frequently, like daily. If they do, you will see benefits. Students will come to see themselves as good in math. You will see better participation in math lessons because there will be less hiding to avoid embarrassment. Students will become more confident in math. Most importantly, they will learn the lesson that hard work and studying pays off. In today's world, many students do not habitually give their best effort at schoolwork. Today's students require motivation to do the hard work of memorizing math facts. Do you know what motivates students? They are motivated by seeing that teachers and adults are impressed by something that they think they can do. It has to be something they can imagine themselves being able to do, and they have to see adults being impressed by it. If you don't care about them making progress learning their math facts, guess what? They won't either. The rocket chart is designed to help students recognize their achievements as they do them. That makes it very important for motivation. You must print out enough color in rocket charts for all your students. The rocket chart is where we got our name Rocket Math. It is the most important part of the program because it helps students realize they are making progress. Click on tab J to get the color in rocket chart. This shows a blank chart. Print enough for every student. Staple them onto a manila folder or something that will last as they pull it out and color in sections on a daily basis. Students color in each phase, takeoff, orbit, and universe in each of the 26 A to Z levels. This is a key part of motivating students. Enable the daily progress report so that you can be sent an email that tells who passed a level yesterday. As students complete each phase, please give them the time to savor their achievement by coloring it in. It's important. Be impressed by their progress. Here's what a color in rocket chart looks like when it is being used. They really enjoy documenting their success by using the color in rocket chart. Every one of the 78 steps to complete a learning track is celebrated in the Rocket Math Online Tutor. Students recognize they are learning. They really have pride in what they have learned. Dr. Don has never been introduced to a student working in Rocket Math who didn't immediately announce what level of the rocket chart he or she was on. In the online tutor, we have a host of voices to provide congratulations every step of the way. Mission Control here, you did it. Well, boy and howdy, you could try the universe. Our heartfelt congratulations on your remarkable accomplishment. Forget about it. You totally took off with this set. Lord willing and the creek don't rise, you could take it into the universe. Nope, I reckon I don't believe this. You must have some kind of smarts to put this set into the universe. I say, I say nobody can do that. It's too difficult. Good job. Is there no limit to your learning? Ah, you got this set to take off. Congratulations. I guess you're headed for orbit next. Hey, you passed the set. That's better than I could do, I think. I am proud to be your teacher, and I am amazed that you took the set into the universe. Mission. You can build team spirit with the Rocket Math wall chart. If you enable daily progress reports, you'll be notified which students passed the level yesterday. The wall chart comes with star stickers, which you award to students who have passed a level the day before. They parade up and fill in the wall chart from the bottom up. Set a class challenge to fill a certain number of rows by a certain date. When students fill in the chart with stickers to reach the goal, you pay off and celebrate their hard work. You can get the wall chart at rocketmath.com shop. Once students get started, one of the first complaints you'll hear is about the session completed screen. When it comes up, they can't play again for at least an hour. 
It comes up after each student has played the allowed amount of time, which is 10 minutes by default. Wah, they cry. We don't want to stop. Why do we have to be stopped? Well, that is a key part of the online tutor's motivation. We want students to want to keep playing. We want them to want that for days and weeks. We want them to have to stop while they're feeling anxious to play again. The short session is a feature, not a bug. We don't care how many sessions students start. They could play for five seconds and then quit. We want to know how many sessions they complete. If students log out after passing a part, they won't get credit for a complete session. Students must play until this screen comes up and forces them to stop, or else they have not completed their session. Ask students to show you this screen before they log out, so you can verify they have completed their session. If you let students quit early, they may never get enough practice to learn the facts. Tab K Award Certificates is where you'll find colorful certificates that you can use to recognize effort. It is critical to reward effort, which everyone can put in, rather than success because some have it easy and others have it harder. There are three kinds of award certificates available, general awards, star effort awards, and eventually learning track certificates. There are six different general awards available. Choose one that's appropriate for your situation. If you have students doing more than eight sessions in the last two weeks, they would qualify for star effort awards, which are better and more valuable because they represent enough effort for students to be successful at rocket math. But if you don't have anyone who qualifies for a star effort award, you can start with general awards for the students who are doing the most. We'll show you how to do that in a bit. The true power of motivation does not come from the things you give to students. It comes from the attitude of the adults in the room. If you are impressed enough with the students' efforts to award these with a ceremony, they realize you're impressed. We recommend having a visitor like the principal, a parent, or a math coach to come in and give them out with the teacher and congratulate the students working the hardest. The trouble you go to regarding these awards means you think it's important and therefore these pieces of paper will become honored awards. Dr. Don would give them out and form a receiving line with the other awardees, so each student shook hands with all the other awardees. Each of these certificates does represent a significant achievement and a lot of work and valuable learning. If you act like you're impressed and act like it matters, the students will work hard to achieve this recognition. The engagement chart shows the level of engagement within your school or class. The chart displays the number of students and the percentage of your school or class they represent reaching each of six levels of engagement as measured by sessions completed in the last 14 days. Requiring daily sessions in school is the starting point. Completing one session per day at school in the last 14 days would be 10 sessions. Less than that is not really enough to be learning well. One session each day in school and one more at home would be 20 sessions in the last 14 days. That would merit five stars. If your engagement looks like this chart with most of your students below the line, begin by recognizing any students who have earned a star effort award. More on how to do that in a minute. Within the online tutor, we recognize levels of effort with your effort rate screen. It shows the number of started and completed sessions in the last 14 days in the same format you see on the review progress screen for each student. You see the student on the left started nine sessions and completed eight. That earns two stars. The student on the left started 16 sessions and completed 15, which earned three and a half stars. Completing just one more session would have earned four stars, which is pretty impressive. We tell the students about this in the basic training video, so you should have them watch it if they haven't already. Encourage students to share their effort rating screen with you. 
students see this effort rating screen when they log on. When students show you is a great time to publicly praise students earning more stars. Wow, Ethan, you have three stars for effort. You're really working hard. I'm so impressed. This sends the message to other students that more stars are something to be proud of. If you do this effectively, students will be raising their hand as they log in to show you their effort stars. Be sure to be impressed. Add motivation by recognizing engagement effort, recognizing the students who have completed the most sessions. On the Review Progress tab, scroll down to the individual student data rows. Find the Total Sessions column. By default, it shows the previous two weeks. Use the little gray arrow for sorting the column to go down from the students with the most completed sessions. Recognize the 10 to 20% of the students who are completing the most sessions. Praise, admire, and publicly recognize those students who are completing the most sessions. Maybe put their names on the board. Point out how you are impressed by their hard work. Point out how smart they are going to be by working so hard. Consider awarding certificates to the hardest workers. You can see how many sessions are completed on the review progress screen. To see how many stars students have earned, leave the date set to the default, which is the last 14 days. Then use the little gray arrow to sort this column going down from the most sessions to the least. You can find the students who have completed the most sessions. Eight sessions will earn two stars, 12 sessions will earn three, 16 will earn four, and 20 will earn five stars. Now you're ready to print out Star Effort Awards. Recognize students for two, three, four, and five star effort with the Star Effort Awards found under tab K. These represent serious effort and enough to successfully benefit from the Rocket Math Online Tutor. These are more valuable than the general certificates because they represent more effort. You should be more impressed with students who earn these awards. Award these Star Effort Awards with ceremony. They are like the bronze, silver, and gold medals in the Olympics. Remember, it's not the paper itself. It is the effort they represent, and it is the reaction to it by the adults in the room that matters. Be sure to let the students who earn these awards bask in the glory. Maybe a round of applause. Be sure to bring in other adults, possibly parents, to increase the importance of the recognition. Don't waste a lot of time on it. A mere five minutes of hoopla will do the trick if adults act impressed. Students will work hard to get recognized if they think they can do it. Everyone can complete sessions, so students who are watching the ceremony realize they could do it and get this recognition. The motivation of the ceremony is most effective for the students who don't get it, who are watching. They will want to earn it in the next round, and that motivates them to work harder. Be sure that the award ceremonies are a regular thing every couple of weeks, so those students feel like they have a good chance of receiving it if they work hard. The next step in motivation is to begin recognizing accomplishment, not just effort. To recognize accomplishment, start awarding learning track certificates as soon as students begin to finish learning tracks. If you enable learning track alerts on your dashboard, the system will send you an email notifying you which student has finished a learning track and the appropriate learning track certificate will be attached to the email. How's that for service? They are signed by Dr. Don, and then you sign them as well. Give them out in your award ceremony, and obviously these are an even bigger deal than the other awards. Students who complete all 16 learning tracks all the way to Z can receive a trophy and a personalized certificate for their achievement. Send an email to Angela at rocketmath.com with the username and the real name of the student, their grade, along with the name of the teacher and the school's mailing address. Once we verify the achievement, we'll mail the trophy and certificate to the teacher. 
This is an amazing accomplishment, but students are doing it all over the country. Currently, Pennsylvania has the most winners. Tab L on the rainbow navigation bar is the toughness certificate. This is for motivating students who are struggling. We mentioned this on a previous video as something you'd want to use if you accidentally reset a student's learning track back to set A, making them do it all over again. This award is for students who need some extra perseverance. Click on tab L and you can see and print this toughness certificate. Here's how to use the toughness certificate. Print a copy and post the certificate in your room. When a student is struggling and starts to complain about having to redo part of a learning track, or when they complain about how hard rocket math is, take them over to the certificate and tell them, I know this is hard. It takes a lot of perseverance to keep going all the way to level Z. If you can do it without whining about it, then you will earn this toughness certificate. Not everyone can earn this, but if you prove you're not a whiner, I will award this to you. Dr. Don knows how hard this is, and he and I will have signed this for you, and you will have earned it. If the student perseveres, make a ceremony of awarding this toughness certificate and read the copy aloud in front of the class. You'll make them proud, and you'll be on your way to teaching a valuable life lesson, perseverance. Dr. Don has been sharing rocket math in various forms with teachers for over 20 years. He guarantees it works. He personally guarantees rocket math will work or your money back. This has been part five, motivating students in the series about making the best use of the rocket math online tutor. The other parts are part one, first steps, part two, Fluency data from one minute races. Part three, review progress tab. Part four, why is the tutor speed so fast? I hope you have viewed all of them.